Split Decision is the 13th episode of Two of a Kind, and this is a really good episode. It actually focuses less on Mary-Kate and Ashley and more on Carrie and Kevin, but the stories we get are pretty decent. So there will be some spoilers now as I discuss what happens in this. I won't go into a tremendous amount of detail, but I will explain the outcomes of certainly a mystery. There's a little bit of mystery involving a character, and I feel like it was kind of obvious what it was but maybe not completely and I couldn't remember this episode from my childhood so I had no idea what the actual outcome would be and I really thoroughly enjoyed it so there will be spoilers from now and the story with Mary Kate and Ashley involves the twins fed up of being twins and this happens because Ashley uh, her friend had a spare ticket to I think it was an Usher concert but she didn't ask Ashley because she was worried it would hurt Mary Kate's feelings would not surprise me if that genuinely was a true story. I don't have any reason to suspect it is, but I wouldn't be surprised if somebody told me that this story came about because of something that actually happened. And Mary Kate and Ashley decide they're both fed up of being twins and having to share everything. So Mary Kate moves into the attic. And honestly, we don't get enough of that story as I would have liked. I think they could have done a little bit more with that. We could have seen more of Mary-Kate feeling lonely in the attic, more of Ashley feeling like she was missing her sister. We didn't really get a lot of that. So they could have maybe shifted the focus slightly, but at the same time, we get this amazing scene with Kevin that makes it so worth it. Because I won't say exactly how we get there, but it makes sense within the context of the episode. Carrie ends up meeting Kevin's doctor. And this is Dr. Martinson, played by Ben Reed, And they end up going on a date. Carrie and the doctor and when the doctor hugs Carrie goodnight she feels something and we don't immediately know what it is but then she tells Kevin the next day she won't be seeing him again because he wears a bra she felt a bra under his shirt and I do think it was immediately obvious that that's not what it was but I wasn't 100% sure what it was I assumed it would be something medically but I didn't have all of the answers. And as I said, couldn't remember. And we do eventually find out what it is. Now I'll say what it is in a moment. But first we get that awesome scene where Kevin is doing the stress test and he's on the treadmill and the doctor is demanding Kevin to tell him why Carrie won't return his calls. And he cranks up the treadmill and makes Kevin run. And I, ju I just think Christopher Sieber's performance there was absolutely fantastic. Exhausting, but fantastic. And... Obviously, finally, he reveals that Car Carrie hasn't phoned him back because he wears a bra. And the doctor reveals it's a, a heart monitor that he's trialing for some uh, some new equipment. He's testing it out. And I was kind of right. I had a feeling it would be some kind of medical thing. My other thought was uh, a back brace or something like that. But I didn't fully work it out. But either way, I thought that worked very well. Nice message about not assuming things and also not judging people. I will say that this episode might have played out differently had it aired today. They probably would have gone down, well, maybe would have gone down the hole if a man wants to wear a supportive device or a bra or something else, they can. But obviously they took a different angle here and it worked very, very well. So that part of the episode does take up more time than the story with Mary Kate and Ashley. But I enjoyed it so much, particularly Kevin's reaction to it all. I didn't really mind it. It's still a good episode. Split Decision is definitely one that I enjoyed.